Great day, great day, and welcome everybody. Welcome to Champion Chef Competition. My name is Diamond McNulty. I'm your executive chef and the creator of Chef Diamond and Friends. So Chef Diamond and Friends is Chef Diamond and Friends is a culinary brand to help kids, teach kids how to cook and expose them to healthy eating. So I'm always excited when I have our young chefs join us inside of the kitchen. And today we have two amazing young chefs that are going to show their mastery, show their skills inside of the kitchen. We have Chef TJ and Chef Q, which is Chef Timothy and Chef Quentin. So I'm going to bring them in very quickly, but I want to make sure everyone is ready to enjoy uh, to, to join us inside of the kitchen. So here we go. Let's get ready. Let's get started. Adding to the stage, we have Chef TJ. Hello. Welcome, Chef. How are you doing today? Good. Awesome. Thank you for joining us inside of the kitchen. I just wanted to do a quick introduction. If you would like to introduce yourself, Chef. My name is Chef TJ, a.k.a. Chef Timothy. Um, I am 10 years old, and I've been cooking since I was six. So my favorite dish is crab cakes and salt. I love it. I love it. I love it. Well, thank you for joining us inside of the kitchen. I know you're excited to get started, right? Right. Here we go. Okie dokie. So, and secondly, here we go. I'm going to introduce Chef Key, Chef Quentin. Welcome, Chef. Hi. My How are you doing? How are you doing, Chef? I'm doing good. Okay. Let's introduce yourself. Hi, my name is Chef Quentin. I am nine years old and I've been cooking for two years. And my favorite meal from this year is the zesty lemon pasta. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. We're, we're about to get ready and get started. I know we have some viewers that are here in the comments. So if you are watching us live on this championship competition, feel free to comment inside of the uh, section below, and I'll be able to read the comments to our young chefs while we're getting started. I'm going to add them both to our kitchen right here. So here we go. We have Chef TJ and we have Chef Q. We have one hour to cook. But before we get started, chefs, what's the first thing that we do when we enter the kitchen? Um, we check for our ingredients. You can say check for our ingredients. What's the, what's the first thing we do? Wash our hands. Oh, wash we wa we wash our hands, so let's go wash our hands, Chef. Chef Q, you were right on point. That's number two, right? So let's wash our hands, and then we're going to get started with our competition. Chef. Yes, indeed. The cutting board camera. Yes, indeed. I got you, Chef. I'm going to put that on. Okay, Chef. So here we go. So Chef TJ, your hands are nice and clean. We're washing our hands. Okay, Chef Quinn, we're washing our hands. Here we go. That is awesome. Okay, next we're going to do our what is called our mise en place check-in, Chefs. Okay, so I'm adding our cutting board and our ingredients to the camera. So as we washed our hands, second thing we want to do is we want to make sure we have all of our ingredients. So today, as you are navigating the kitchen, I want you chefs to call out some of the ingredients that you have. I'll start with you, Chef TJ. You call out two or three ingredients. Uh, lemon, mango, and red bell pepper. Okay, Chef Q, do you have all three of those ingredients? I do. Okay, hold it up for us. Lemon, mango, and bell pepper. Um, here's the juice. Okay, okay. The bell pepper. Okay, I love it, I love it. And the mango. Okay, there we go. Okay, next thing, Chef, call it out. Um, cherry tomatoes and jalapeno and red onion. Okay, perfect. So here's our red onions. Uh huh. Here's our jalapenos. Okay. 
And they're red onion. Or gotcha, gotcha. Okay. And the tomato. And tomatoes. Okay, perfect. Okay, TJ. Now do y'all have y'all chicken? Yes. Okay, hold hold up your chicken and your quinoa. Yeah. Okay, perfect. We got our chicken. We got our chicken. Okay, looking great. What about your king? I see your quinoa, Chef. Chef Q, do you have your quinoa? Oh, I do. Okie dokie. Hold it up for me, Chef. Okay, perfect. Looking great. So now we're going to rock and roll. We're going to get started. Oh, TJ, call out the last ingredients that you have. Uh, chicken, mm -hmm. chicken, cucumber, mm -hmm. Olive oil and salad greens. Yes, indeed. Hold those items up, Chef. So here's the cucumber. Mm -hmm. uh, here's the chicken. Mm -hmm. And um, and um, here. Yeah. yeah, salad greens. Salad greens. Okay, we got our salad greens. Okie dokie. So, as I've mentioned, okay, so first thing we did, we washed our hands. Second thing, we checked in our mise en place. Everyone is inside of the kitchen. You both look amazing. We're going to get started. Are there any questions? No. Okie dokie, chef. So, we have one hour. Okay, so I'm going to be asking you questions in between while you're cooking, and you can just come to the camera and cook. But Let's take about a couple of minutes, and I want you to get started. Let's rock and roll. All right. Okie dokie. Okay, so and we're off. We have Chef TJ. He's over there. He's starting with his chicken. Okay. Chef Quentin is grabbing his chicken. Okay. So, chefs, are y'all going to sear your chicken today or are you going to grill it? Grill it. Oh, okay. Sear it. Okay, perfect. I love it. I love it. Here we go. And they're moving around the kitchen. Jeff Quinn is adding some EVO to his pan. Here we go. Chef, Chef Timothy is starting. He has his chicken down over there. Now he's starting to cut his mango. Okay. Perfect. I see him peeling his mango. Looking great. Let's see. Okay. Perfect. So we have his hands cutting over there. Now, to all of the viewers that are watching, I want to I want to thank y'all for joining us. <laughs> we have some comments in the. We have some comments. Let's go, China man! Awesome. So, just wanted to welcome everyone who is just joining us right now for our Champion Chef Cooking Competition. We have two young chefs. We have Chef TJ and we have Chef Quentin, Chef Q. They're inside of the kitchen. It's going to be an exciting day today. They're making grilled chicken with mango salsa and quinoa salad so that's the great thing about it so all of our young chefs have been cooking for around two to seven years so chef q here we go he's over there he's getting everything going if you can see him getting started he has his saute he has his pan on is heating up he has his chicken going now we have Chef TJ over here. He's getting busy with his mango salsa. Okay, awesome. We have our new angle. He's seasoning up his chicken. I see it. Looking good. Great seasoning. Salt and pepper. Okay. Awesome job. Looking great. Okay, so he has his chicken seasoned on both sides. I see it. 
looking great, Chef. So that's a great thing. He touched the chicken, but then he also washed his hands. That's important, right? No cross contamination. And he has his towel. Great job, Chef. Great job. So he has his towel. Okay. Now back to Chef TJ. TJ is in here. And he is still cutting up all his vegetables. He's making his mango salsa. <laughs> the comments are going great. Looking great. Okay, Chef. Here you go. So, Chef TJ, your camera is a bit down. Can we move your cutting board camera up just a tad bit? Sorry. It's okay. Can you see it now? If not, if not, then no problem. Yep, I see you squeezing the lime juice. We can rock and roll. I don't want to stop you. I see your mangoes are cut up, and I see you adding some lime juice on it, right? Right. I love it. Great job, Chef. Great job. Okay, so now he's going to his bell pepper. Okay. He's cutting off the top. He's pulling out the inside, the stem and everything inside of our bell pepper, cleaning our bell pepper. Looking great, Chef. He's cutting off the bottom. That's perfect. Now, the great thing about this is we have 90% of our bell peppers we can use. And he's doing an outstanding job with his cuts. And he's quick and efficient. Great job, Chef. Now we're back to Chef Quinn. He has his pan is hot. He has his chicken going down in the saute pan. Looking great. You can hear that sizzle. He's washing his hands. That is wonderful. I love it. Thank you to all of the viewers coming in. This is our live champion chef cooking competition where we have chefs from around the world competing against each other and just having fun, right? So we have healthy dishes that they prepare. Okay, chefs. Looking great. So there we go. So Chef TJ, he's cutting up the rest of his bell pepper and he's adding it to his salsa. He's making his mango salsa. Great job. See, we have some. Let's go, little Quentin. Okay, Quentin, let's go. Great job, TJ. Okay. Looking great. So he has, he's adding, Chef, are you adding cilantro or parsley, mm -hmm. Chef? <laughs> okay, you're adding cilantro. Okay, looking great. I love it. <laughs> he said he know how to use a knife. Yeah, he is putty. Okay. So now we're going back over here. Chef Quinn has his chicken searing looking good. So chefs, are y'all going to cook your chicken on the stove top 100% or are y'all going to finish it off in the oven? Stove top 100%. Stove top 100%? Um, I can't hear you. Say that. Are you, gonna, are you gonna cook your entire chicken on the stove top or are you gonna finish it in the oven? Cook it on the stove top. Stove top. Let's rock and roll. I love it, Chef. I see you grabbing your mango. You're getting ready to make, make your mango salsa. Okay, looking great. Now we have Chef TJ. He is over here. He's getting his chicken going. Okay. Getting his chicken going. Great, Chef. Chef Quinn is adding his ingredients to his bowl. I love it. I love it. Looking great. That Chef TJ is back. Yeah. <laughs> 
You say you hear that? You hear the sizzle coming from the kitchen. Let's see it. <laughs> there we go. I love it. PJ got that spatula like SpongeBob. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, so let me go back. Okay, here we go. Chef Quinn is searing his chicken on one side. He's going to flip his chicken shortly. There we go. While he's doing that, Chef TJ, TJ is cutting some cucumber. <laughs> Outstanding job, Chef. Outstanding job. Looking great. Okay. The so chef is clearing off his cutting board while he's cutting his other ingredients. Okay, chefs. So now, chefs, remember, I know that we have our chicken going. What about our quinoa? Do, are we preparing our quinoa? Do we have our water on for our quinoa? Yes, sir. Okie dokie. Let's rock and roll. Here we go. Chef Quinn, how are you looking over there, Chef? I saw you making your mango salsa. I'm looking good. Okay, I love it. Awesome. So he has his onions, bell peppers, mango inside the bowl. Looking great, Chef. Looking great. Okay, he's adding a little spice to it. Jalapeno peppers. We have some more comments. It's all in the wrist. Looking awesome. As we go back, Chef TJ is over here. He's cutting up his lime, his lemon. Oh, uh, Chef, I am about to add some cilantro to my mango sauce. I mean, okay. South. Okay. I love it. He's adding cilantro. Okay. Keep it rolling, Chef. I love it. He pulled out all stops. Outstanding. Now we have Chef. Chef TJ is adding salt and pepper to his too. Chef Quinn is adding his. Right? We want to make sure we have flavorful dishes. Looking great. Okay. <laughs> Outstanding. Thank you everyone that's joining us today. So if you have a young chef that's interested in cooking, they can definitely sign up and register. We love hosting our champion chef cooking competitions. Looking great, Chef Q. I see you mixing up your mango salsa. You added some salt and pepper to it. Making sure the flavor is great. Okay, so Chef TJ is putting his in a the bowl. There we go right there. Mixing it up. Okay. I love it. Perfect. So we had that chicken over there. He's searing that he seared his chicken. That Chef Quinn is getting some water. Awesome. We go for everyone in so we can see all angles. 
Outstanding job, Chef. Yeah, so Chef Quinn is putting the, the pot on the stove. Okay. Perfect. Chef TJ is rocking and rolling. I see him over there as well. Outstanding job. <laughs> Say Gordon Ramsay. Oh no, that's Chef Q. His chicken is seared on one side, okay. Looking great. He's flipped it over. Perfect. And it's a thin chicken breast, right? So we want to make sure we want to make sure our chicken is fully cooked. That's wonderful. Okay, so Chef TJ is squeezing. Is are you squeezing lime juice, Chef? Bring us up to speed on where you are. I am squeezing lemon juice. You're squeezing lemon juice. Okay. I'm squeezing lemon juice over my prep ingredients for the quinoa, and then I'm also doing it for the mango salad as well. I love it. I love it. Great job. Great job, Chef Quinn. How you doing over there? I'm doing. Um, you doing good? Yo, awesome. This is exciting. As the time ticks, chefs, we are 20 minutes in. 21 minutes in. Rocking and rolling. Everyone's looking great. Our chicken is almost fully cooked. So I see we have our quinoa cooking, our mango salsa is nearly completed so our chefs are wiping down our stations okay so chefs what, what plates are you what platters are you using for your final presentation i am using this fancy plate of my chicken quinoa and mango and awesome while, while the salsa is not on the chicken you're gonna put it on the side, chef, like that. Awesome. I'm gonna leave some on the side and pour some on the chicken. Outstanding job, chef. Okay, hold on for me one second, chef Quinn. Talk to me. Talk to me, chef. Um, I am going to put this on the plate. You're gonna put your mango sauce on the plate. Yes, I am. Uh, Okie dokie. Are you going to put it on top of the chicken or underneath the chicken? On top of the chicken. Okay, I love it. Great job, Chef. I am putting my mixed salad greens in a strainer and rinse mm -hmm. it. I love it. Making sure our mixed greens are nice and clean. There we go. Looking great. So our chicken breast is cooking on both sides, chefs. Okay. So if you have a perfect mixed greens are nice and clean. And then also if you had a salad spinner, you can spin them, right? Make sure they're dry. I'll bring, I'll loop you in on one chef, but looking great. We have some more comments. Save me some, chefs. <laughs> I'm using this for my salad. Uh huh. The other bowl for my chicken. Okay, awesome. Great job, chef. He's he's cleaning it. Okay, chef Quinn is stirring his pot with his quinoa. So, and if you have any questions that you would like to ask the young chefs, feel free to comment. Feel free to leave it in the comments and I'll be sure to ask our young chefs. Okay. So Chef, T Chef TJ, where are you cooking from? I am cooking from McDonough, Georgia. McDonough, Georgia. Chef Quentin, where are you cooking from? 
I am cooking from Illinois, Chicago. Chicago. Okay, so we have Chicago versus McDonough, Georgia. I love it. Great job, chefs. Oh. Okie dokie. So we have a question. So today they're doing grilled chicken with mango salsa and quinoa salad, chefs. The chefs are doing an amazing job. They've already seared their chicken. They had their chicken nearly fully cooked. Uh, we have our quinoa going on the stove. Uh, Chef TJ and Chef Quinn have already made their mango salsa, right? Right. So now we're rocking and rolling. Okay. Chef TJ, uh, can you move the Dawn over just a bit? That is that the spray? Oh, yes. Sorry. It's okay. Perfect. Looking great, yes. Chef is pulling out his chicken. We're making sure our chicken is what? 165, right? Fully cooked. Sure. Making sure. Okay. So he has his chicken. Okay, Chef Quinn, you have your chicken looking, Chef. Is it fully cooked yet? It's almost there. Okay, he was given the last follow-up zero on the on the perfect, looking good. Yeah, looking good. Awesome. It's all there. <laughs> awesome. I love it. So we had some let's go TJ. Then we have some shot time. Outstanding job. There we go. Okay, so let me add to the stage. Chef TJ's over here. He's working on a final plate presentation. Chef, how's your quinoa? Is your quinoa almost fully cooked? Almost. Okay, perfect. Looking great. So the chicken is looking good. Okay, chef, so you're taking your pan off the stove. He's cleaning up as you go. Okay. I love it, chef. So Chef Quinn, you have your quinoa going, you have your chicken almost cooked. Chef Quinn, what platter are you using for yours? Uh, well, let's make sure we grab our, our, we can use that. And also Chef, if you have an oven mitt, oh, you're using that for your platter? That looks great. If you have an oven mitt, Chef, let's make sure we use oven mitts to grab hot pots. Oh, you got it, Chef. Great job. Yep. Take your time, Chef. Chef. Talk to me, Chef. Um, oh, I thought you had a question. Yes, Chef. Um, the is almost done. I have my salad rings in the bowl, my mango salsa on the side. Mm -hmm. We have our chicken in the preparation. We have our chicken in the with the mango salsa on the top. And then mm -hmm. we have the quinoa to finish. I love it. I love it. Great job, Chef. Chef Quinn, I know he's over there straining his. Okay. 
Looking good. He's putting his in the bowl. Okay, perfect. He's adding some ingredients to his quinoa. Outstanding. Outstanding. Okay, Chef, what are you adding to your quinoa? I added um, cucumbers and lemon juice. I love it. Okay, Chef, great job. And, and tomatoes. Love it. Yeah. Okay. So everyone who is joining us, I, I have. Mm -hmm. Talk to me, Chef Q. I added extra virgin olive oil. I love it. I love it. Okay. He's adding EVO to it. I am adding salt to my food. Awesome. He's adding salt, so he has cucumber. He's adding salt, EVO. He's adding pepper. Looking great. Outstanding job, Chef. He's gonna mix it in, okay. Right, so you're gonna make it all nice and delicious. Today they're preparing grilled chicken with mango salsa and quinoa salad. Looking great, Chef. Okay. So he temp he tempt his chicken. Want to make sure our temperature is 165 for everyone who is watching. Fully cooked chicken. He has a thermometer in. I love it. Great job, Chef. Okay, Chef, I see you adding some some goodies to your quinoa. I am adding chicken. And then I'm adding, I'm adding cucumber, tomato, and cilantro. Okay, cucumber, tomato, and cilantro. I love it. Yep. Great job. So Chef Quinn, he just he just fully cooked his chicken. Okay. Now we have his quinoa. Okay, Chef. Okay, Chef. Do we do we taste our quinoa? How does it taste? It tastes good. Okay, I love it. Right. So as chefs, we make sure we taste everything before it leaves the kitchen. Great job. So everyone that's watching what they're preparing is below. As we mentioned, welcome to Chef Diamond and Friends Champion Chef Cooking Competition, live competition where our young chefs are competing to show their culinary skills. We're chefs from around the world, so I'm excited. We have Chef PJ from McDonough, Georgia. And we have Chef Quinn from Chicago, Illinois. Okay, I got you, Chef TJ. 
have your station set up. I am putting my my Okay, you starting to plate it up? Okay. Are you placing the on my plate? Okay, awesome. So he, he has the quinoa going on the, in the bowl on his plate. There we go. Great job, Chef. So and he put it in a bowl and it flipped it over so that he can make a presentation out of the quinoa. We have some more comments in there. This is awesome. Thank you, everyone, for joining us. Are there any questions in the comments? No questions as of yet. There was only one question where someone asked what you guys were cooking. I love it. Great job, chefs. All right, nephew TJ. Let's go, Chef Quinn. Let's go, TJ. I need to make that drive for a plate. Outstanding. I see we have spinach going down on a platter. Okay. We have some greens going down on top. Looking great. So we're counting down, chefs. You have a little over 20 minutes left for you to make your final presentation. We're going to have a quick Q&A. But I want to make sure everyone has their final dish, your final presentation. I'm going to ask you a couple questions. And then we're going to ask everyone in the comments to judge the dishes. Looking great, chefs. Chicken rest for three to five minutes. Okay, so you let your chicken rest, Chef? I am. I love it. Why are you letting your chicken rest? Because because um, I know. You got it. Because the juice is coming out of it. And I and I don't want just to go all over my space. I love it. I love it. So he let his chicken rest for three to five minutes. So for everyone who's watching, if you're ever cooking a chicken breast, when you sear it on both sides, that's to seal in the juices. So once it's fully cooked, you want to let it rest so that all of the juices that were on the outer layer of the chicken don't come directly out of the chicken. If you let it rest, those juices go back into the chicken and make your chicken juicy. Great job, Chef. If you cut it too early, then your chicken will become dry. All the juices will come out. So great job, Chef. I love the explanation. <laughs> I love the competition. And I must say, my grandson is handling his business. Way to go, Quentin. See that my boy TJ give his chicken a breather. Great job. Great presentations are coming together. So for everyone who's watching, we, we cook on Saturdays twice a month with all of our young chefs. If you want any more information, you can visit chefdiamondandfriends.com. We just have fun inside of the kitchen. It starts off with teaching our kids how to cook, but then we focus on healthy eating afterwards. Great job, Chef Q. I see our plate coming together. Let's 
looking wonderful. Chef TJ, okay, you're cutting up some last minute. Is those are those cucumbers? Let's see. We're getting down to the okay, looking great. Outstanding job, chef. Okay, so he has the quinoa on the platter with the tomatoes and the salad. His, his chicken is resting. Chef CJ is cleaning up. Okay, Chef Quentin is now cutting his chicken and he's using his bear claw. Okay. So for everyone, whenever you're cutting something, we want to make sure our hands are nice and tucked. Our fingers are nice and tucked with our bear claw so that we don't cut our fingers. Okie dokie, looking great. Now he's going to grab his platter and he's going to put his final, he's going to put his chicken on there. Great job, chef. Okay, meanwhile, we have Chef TJ over here cleaning down his station. That's extremely important, Chef. I love it. We want to always make sure our station stays nice and clean. Outstanding. Outstanding. Okay, Chef Quinn is working on his final presentation. He's trying to figure out how he's going to present it. I love it. I love it. Great job, Chef. Okay, Chef TJ is finalizing his presentations too. He's cleaning up his station. He want to do his final setup. Outstanding. So TJ, walk me Walk me through your current state. What what do you have going on, Chef? What did you say? I couldn't hear you. Walk me through your current state. Where are you at right now with your dish? I am in. I am. I am done plating actually. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm and then I'm just cleaning up my station and getting ready for preparation. I love it. So Thank TJ you. is. TJ has finalized his dish. He's getting ready. Cleaning down. Ensuring that everything is set. Okay. And we're going to turn it over to Chef Quentin. Hold on for me one second, Chef. Okay, Chef Q, talk to me. How's everything going? Well, it tastes good. So <laughs> That's good. Food tastes good. How's your plate presentation? You're almost done with your final presentation? Um, I'm almost done. Okay, I love it. I love it. So when you're done, let's bring our, our presentations to the center of our uh, stations, and we're going to talk about it, okay? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I love it. Outstanding job, outstanding job. So for everyone who is watching, thank you for joining us on YouTube and thank you everyone for joining us on Facebook as well. We have Chef TJ and Chef Q competing in our live championship competition. Today they're preparing grilled chicken with mango salsa and quinoa salad. They've both done an amazing job, and they're working on their final presentations right now. So I'm excited to bring everything to everyone so you can see their final presentations. And then I'm going to place a poll. For those of you, let me see if I can place the poll on YouTube and place a poll on Facebook for everyone to comment. <laughs> Go 
That is awesome. So we have the the grilled chicken with the mango salt mango salsa on top, and we have quinoa right here. Mm -hmm. And then we have uh, we have our mixed greens right here. Mm -hmm. And then we have the extra mango salsa up here. Mango, okay, great job, chef. Looking great. So he has a trio. That's creative. I love it, chef. So he has his trio set up. Okay, perfect. All three dishes he put together. Outstanding job, chef TJ. Thank you. Okay, so chef Q is almost done. He's working on his final presentation he's going to bring it to the front he's cleaning up his stations great job great job chefs outstanding job chefs thank you i love it thank you all for joining us today on this wonderful saturday what better place than to be than this side of the kitchen Sorry. It's okay, Chef. So Chef Quinn is cleaning down. So Chef, okay, as we're cleaning down, I'm going to give you, I see TJ is done. Chef Quinn, how are you looking on your final dish? I'm looking good. I just have to add to the sauce. Okay, perfect. Perfect. He's going to add his mango salsa and then he's almost done. So it seems like our chefs are both ahead of schedule. I love it. I love when food is on time. On time. It's nothing like coming to a restaurant and having food that's not on time. <laughs> so we have some comments in this that says, good job, young man. Way to go, TJ. Way to go, China man. Good job, chefs. Thank you. Then we have you. I know your grandfather would love your chicken. Wow, that looks amazing. Thanks, Chef Q. Now my Wendy's don't look as good. <laughs> yeah, no Wendy's today. No Wendy's. Today we're going to their house. Great job for both chefs. Both did an amazing job. Yes, I'm extremely proud of both of our young chefs. I'm going to mute my mic. Sounds great, chef. Both chefs are outstanding. Okay. So while we come down to the end, we're going to prepare a and a for both of our chefs. While we come down to the end. Here we go. I want to make sure everyone is set. So while we come down to the end, chefs, and all of our chefs are finalizing their dishes. I wanted to jump on really quickly. And I want to thank you personally for joining us today inside of the kitchen with Chef Diamond and Friends Champion Chef Cooking Competition. We have Chef TJ and Chef Quentin competing in our live competition. So it's always exciting to have our young chefs inside of the kitchen. And we want to continue to encourage other young chefs that are not inside of the kitchen. We don't want Uber Eats. There's a refrigerator full of food. We want to ensure that our chefs are equipped to navigate the kitchen. So I have to thank. So I have to thank all of the parents for all of the wonderful work that you're doing with both young chefs. You're, you're doing an outstanding job because they both are doing great inside of the kitchen, whether it's from uh, the, the navigating the cooking of the chicken, you know, the salad, washing their hands ensuring that they have all of their knees and plies set up. They've done an outstanding job. So I'm personally excited 
and I'm proud of both of them. So as they're finishing up their plates right now, I see Chef Quentin is finishing up his plate. I want to open it up for any questions. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments. And then I'm going to open it up for any last minute thoughts from our young chefs. OK, so I'm going to start off with Chef TJ. Let's rock and roll. One second. Let me make sure that we're set. OK. Okay, Chef, any last minute comments? Any last minute thoughts? How was your preparation for today? How was your dish? Uh, my dish is pretty good, actually. The mango, the mango sauce is something, something new for me. So that's a uh, first time experience. And then quinoa, I've never worked with quinoa before. So this was a great experience. I love it. I love it. Okay, one second, chefs. I want to make sure that we're set. It seems like we're stuck a bit. Your screen is frozen, chef. Okay, here we go. One second, chef. We're going to continue. I see Chef Quentin is finalizing his dish, and then I'm going to bring myself back in. Hold on for me one second. Okay, so I am back. That is something. Okay, Chef TJ. Hello. Are you ready to rock and roll? Let me see Chef Quentin. Are you ready to rock and roll? I have to restart our studio. Chef Quentin, so let me set up for you. Here we go. Give me a few overview. How was your day today? <laughs> that looks amazing. Okay, Chef, if you can, explain your dish and let us know how was your cooking experience today? So I have quinoa, tomatoes, uh, green um, hot beans and I have cucumbers you know I, 
I also have um, chicken, um, mango salsa, and greens. Looking great. Great job, Chef. Did you enjoy your experience today? Did you have fun inside of the kitchen? I had fun. Um, this was my first time making quinoa. In, in the, so I enjoyed the dish. I love it. I love it. And as you said, it tastes good as well. Any last minute things that you want to say to everyone watching? Uh, thank you for the support in the comments. I love it. I love it. Okay, I'm going to bring both chefs back. Okay, Chef TJ, you're back on. Okay, so you may have to unmute yourself, Chef. Hello. Okay, perfect. So I would like for both of our chefs to hold up their dishes. Uh, can you bring my cutting board camera up? Yeah, I'll, there you I go, Chef. Okay. Perfect. Okay, so we have both dishes right there for everyone that's watching. Um, I want to say thank you for all the support and shout out to all the people in the comments. And yeah. Great job. Great job. Both of our chefs did an amazing job. I would love for all of our chefs to take pictures. I'm going to place a poll inside of our Facebook and those on YouTube. And I want everyone, if you can, we're going to judge both of our young chefs on various things. So one, we're judging our chefs on final plate presentation. Okay, so if you can, I'm doing it on Chef Diamond and Friends. Here we go. We're going to do a plate presentation. We're going to do a on communication, right? How well our chefs were able to communicate their dish, right? Communicate what they was doing and why they were doing it. That's always important to ensure sorry, that they are. Sorry, sorry. It's okay. it's okay, chef, that they are making the right steps towards the final dish. Looking great. I love it. So the whole... Here we go. And then we're going to announce both of our winners on Monday. We're going to announce our winner on Monday for the championship competition. So once we see the poll get activated, I want to ensure that everyone has some time to comment. I know there were some that were watching us that have stepped away, but then also there are some that are going to watch this replay today, tomorrow, and uh, maybe even Monday morning. So I want everyone to watch the replay, watch our chefs, and continue to show your support for them and Champion Chef competition. Okay, chefs, hold up both of your dishes again. Perfect, perfect. Remember to take pictures because on our on our on our page we're gonna place both pictures. Outstanding job. Let's give them a round of applause in the comments, chefs. Let's give everyone, let's give them some thumbs up. Let's give them some hearts. Let's give them some love. Show them as much love as possible. Come here for, for me, real Q. Good job, boys. Good job, chefs. Good job, TJ, big dog. Gotta have some Anita Baker playing in the background next time. <laughs> sure thing. So proud of you, Quentin. Amazing work, chefs. Someone says, I want a plate. I want a plate. So, and let's thank our sous chefs. Thank you, sous chefs, for helping out inside of the kitchen. We greatly appreciate you as well. You both did an outstanding job. Give yourselves a round of applause, chefs. Wonderful. So we're right on schedule. Both dishes look great. They're gonna, our chefs are going to send us pictures. And then feel free. We're going to have a poll that is going to be on our Facebook page. I want you guys to, to vote. 
at Chef Diamond and Friends Facebook. I'm going to place up our poll where you can vote on our champion chef winner. And it's going to be based on various criteria that I said, I mentioned earlier. And I look forward to seeing you next time inside of the kitchen. Thank you all. Y'all want to say bye-bye? Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>